This is Union Street, Montego Bay, St. James, Jamaica. It starts further up the road. However, today we are taking a walking tour, focusing on the prominent establishments and historical sites on this street. This may very well be considered by some a purely subjective assessment. Hi, I'm Tina, your self-professed friendly Jamaican tour guide. I hope you have an on 2020 new year. Now let's begin at Montego Bay High School, which was established in 1935 as the first government-owned high school for girls in Jamaica. It was originally called Beaconsfield High. This is the entrance of Richmond Hill Inn, built in 1804. The site offers a beautiful view of the entire city of Montego Bay. The blue building on your screen houses the National Housing Trust. This was created by the Government of Jamaica to offer low interest loans to be used by contributors to buy, build or repair their homes. Across the street from Montego Bay High School and the National Housing Trust is Overton Plaza. Here we have Della Pena Funeral Home, a family-owned and operated establishment. Across the street is the Old Slave Ring, a significant historical site that I spoke about in the video linked above. This old house is called Rary's House. The Old Slave Ring is found on the same property. Please be on the lookout for an upcoming video on this house. Don't forget to subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss it. I truly have a special love for these buildings and would love to build a house with these bricks. Here we are coming up on Madden's funeral home. Yes, yet another funeral home on Union Street. The street is so quiet today, hardly any traffic and none of the deafening music that is characteristic of St. James Street, which can without a doubt be dubbed as the busiest street in St. James. The dark blue building that we are now approaching is the Cecil Donaldson Building which houses the St. James Municipal Corporation, formerly St. James Parish Council. The building is named after the former trade unionist and Montego Bay Mayor, Cecil Donaldson. This beautiful Georgian brick house, known as Roundhouse, stands at the corner of Union Street and Orange Street. 
The property is known as Georgian Square and houses another building made of cut stone that was once the main house. It pretty. And finally, Juicy Patties on the corner of Union and St. James Street. What's its historical significance, you may ask? Well, if you don't know, now you do. Patty is the unofficial national dish of Jamaica. So, understandably, any patty establishment is an important landmark on any streets. Okay, thank you very much for watching my sunshines. Remember, if you're my tribe, then subscribe. You know what to do. Hit that button and turn it blue. <laughs> See you next time.